got something really fun for you. Here we are in the mix with all these guys. This is Grisby. I know him over my shoulder. We've also got the vice president from the Utah Grizzlies, of course, our hockey team here in town. And you brought a couple players with you as well. We sure did. This is fun. Introduce us to who you got here today. So I've got Miles Gendron, Joey Colatarci, both all right. big guys. We've got a forward and a defenseman. Uh, with us here. Oh, actually, you're both defensemen, right? Well, Forget about half that. and half. <laughs> it depends what Ryan wants, either your upper back. Uh, do it all. We got playoffs started first round. We played last night, had a big 6 3 win. You won. Nice. And you play won. again tonight. Play again tonight. Now, this is so the fun. first series, the first playoffs. Correct. Of four that we're trying to get to the championship. That's correct. Playing through June. So, count on snow. Through June. Okay, there you go. <laughs> okay, so what time's the game uh, here for today? Seven o'clock tonight. Okay. And we heard about that other playoff game going on at the Vivint, but yeah. you guys are already on a winning path, right? Yeah. One to nothing against <laughs> the Oilers. Correct. Tulsa. Okay, and we've got Grisby here, who's helping us. He's been doing this for 14 years. My goodness. I heard that. That's crazy. Yeah, he's a little bit too old. He might <laughs> I don't know. He's still got some hijinks and super athletic on the ice. He keeps bumping into me over here. I'm sorry. I'm going to keep come on in. creeping come on, over next to you. Know? Now, the Grizzlies have had a banner year. Breaking records. You won the division? Correct. Yeah. Well, the guys can talk all about uh, what they're doing on the ice. Yeah, no, it was a really good year for us. Uh, being able to win the division for the first time is pretty special. Um, so hopefully we can keep it rolling and advance to the next round and just keep, keep going. It's pretty exciting. You know, they gave us a little information on both of you guys, so I understand. One's from Florida, the other one from Massachusetts. I can understand the Massachusetts connection, but Florida, I guess you still found some ice to practice. Yeah, it was, uh, it would rain like every day when I was playing soccer, so I switched to hockey. Go indoors. <laughs> and it was indoors and liked it ever since. Nice. Wow, well congratulations on being here with the Utah Grizzlies. What's it like to be here in Utah? Those games are so much fun. Yeah, it's really special. Uh, this is my second year here, so starting to feel a little bit like home and I just love it. You love all the snow? I guess you're used to it. Yeah, no, the snow here is not as bad as Massachusetts. <laughs> not as bad, even in April, huh? Yeah, no, we get snow in April sometimes. It's all right. bad. All right. <laughs> now, there's still tickets available. I know that attendance ramps up, I'm sure, during the playoffs, but people can still get tickets for it. Absolutely. Them. They can, uh, Maverick Center box office opens up at 2 o'clock, okay. or they can call 988 uh, or go online, So We got all this talent right here. We want to put them to work. Didn't you guys bring your hockey sticks? Uh -oh. there, there are some sticks. Uh oh, yes. are and there you, some sticks <laughs> here? We got our equipment manager. Show us some some skills. All right, they've got our crew manager running to get sticks. Yeah, <laughs> yeah they're going to come and uh, teach Brack a few things. How about that? Right? You got a good golf swing. How's your hockey? Uh, swing? It's been years. I did a little club <laughs> hockey way back in high school, so. So we're talking a few decades ago. Oh, a few decades. I think we've got him. I'll just bring him on in if you've got him. We've All right, so what's, okay, so we've got the first round here. We make it past this. Uh, so you have the two games here at home, and then where do you go away games? Uh, Tulsa, Oklahoma. Tulsa. And then who's your potential opponents after this series? Uh, Rapid City, South Dakota, or Allen, Texas. Okay. Yeah. And then we're going all the way to the championship, right? Yes, sir. Not Super goodness. fun. Ra raise the all right, here we go. The sticks there. Okay, so what's it, What's something you could teach Breck? Yeah. Just right here with the last little 30 seconds we've got. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Hey, you look pretty good there. <laughs> That's well a pretty good start. There. That is, look at this go. Is that it? Hey, oh. there you go. There you go. Perfect. Oh. That's probably a goal. It. <laughs> Maybe the mascot job there. <laughs> Although he's pretty impressive. If he you is impressive. If you have been to a Utah Grizzlies game, they are so much fun. You guys usually have some themes. Anything we can expect if we come on down for the playoffs? You know, uh, playoffs, we do our Feed the Grizz. Okay. So once we score our first goal, fans are encouraged to throw fish on the ice. <laughs> we love it if they're in bags or really, really frozen oh, and no. not fresh. Um, but yeah, we had a lot of throwing last night. It was awesome. Oh, that's and so fun. Doing it again tonight and all the way through the so playoffs. So bring your so. fish. And frozen throw them fish, in this guy. frozen <laughs> fish wrapped up. <laughs> all right, all right, there we got it. Thank you so much for coming in. We really appreciate it. Wish you the best of luck. Yeah, yeah thank you, you so much for the championship. Yeah, absolutely. Congratulations on your season. Yeah, thank, thank you. you. Yeah. Thank you.